Hello again, I'm Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the Supertooth Disco Bluetooth Stereo Speaker. Now if you're anything like me, you love audio. And this is one of these products that I'm very excited to open. Hopefully it will excite me. <laughs> so on the box we have what it is. This is the Supertooth Disco Bluetooth Stereo Speaker A2DP. So yes. This is Bluetooth, completely wireless. I'll have more information on the specs in just a second. On the box itself, picture of the product, and all kinds of features and specifications right here. 2.0 Bluetooth A2DP stereo speaker compatible with any A2DP Bluetooth device, compatible with any MP3 player via cable, compatible with any audio device via cable. It comes with a rechargeable battery that should last anywhere between three and 10 hours, depending upon use. It says three to four hours at maximum volume and 10 hours at medium volume, where it should be most of the time. Charging time is three hours. It's AVRCP profile supported. It comes with a 12 watt subwoofer and two 8 watt speakers. So two 8 watt speakers equals 16 watts plus 12 watts gives you a total of 28 watts. If that's real, it is going to offer some real performance. We'll see about that later on. It's supplied with a wall charger and a travel bag, and they also provide a 3.5 millimeter stereo jack cable. Okay, so let's open this up and see and have a look. It's packed in here pretty tightly. Okay. Nice packaging. This looks like it's the AC adapter. Let me take this out of the bag. Yes, it's the AC adapter. And this is the 3.5 millimeter stereo jack. You can see male to male. The user's manual and the main product, which looks like it's in some kind of a carry pouch. Ooh, very, very fancy. And looks to be high quality. You can see a little place here for the knob to fit in. Velcro is pretty strong. It's not going to come out of there. Ooh, a hole with some mesh here on the bottom. Looks like an access hole as well. So let's have a closer look at this product. First of all, this has amazing build quality and the design is exceptional on this. It is very, very well done. As you can see, kind of like this mesh look on the front, rounded corners, extremely classy. Now this is a portable speaker, so it really isn't that large, which you'd expect from a portable speaker. You can kind of get a better idea. When I put my hand in front of it, my hand is, you know, a medium size hand. The height on this is 89 millimeters. The width is 315 and the depth is 70 millimeters. Now this is also fairly lightweight weighing in at 1,140 grams. Now, as I mentioned previously, this gets anywhere between three to 10 hours on a single three hour charge. If you have it cranked, you'll get between three to four hours at medium volume around 10 hours and standby time on this is insane at 1,500 hours. Now this product is capable of 28 watts RMS and that's supposed to be real. It has an internal subwoofer amplifier power of 12 watts and each of the speakers is eight watts. And by the way, the subwoofer speaker uses a Neodyne high efficiency system and the left and right speakers are full range with parabolic membrane and all of the speakers 
are magnetically shielded. It's Bluetooth version 2. The operating range is around 10 meters and the frequency is 2.4 gigahertz. Here's the volume knob, play, pause button, previous button, next button, on off button, base button and there's a little tiny base LED there as well and this is the Bluetooth status LED. At the back is where the power adapter gets connected. Here's the charge indicator and stereo line input. Now let's charge this product and put it to the test. Now this product will work with just about any device including ones that have a 3.5 millimeter stereo jack. But what really makes this product cool is its Bluetooth capability. So all you need to do to connect it or pair it with a device that has that Bluetooth capability is press and hold this on off button for around five seconds. You see it blinking red and blue. Well then get your Bluetooth cable device out and click on this device. ST Disco R58. It will then ask you for the code. In this case, it's 0000. zero, zero, zero. Okay. Connected to media audio. That's it. Okay, have a listen. This is at half volume. Full volume. So as you can hear, there's no problem filling a pretty large room using this portable speaker. Now I really do enjoy decent audio on my main computer gaming rig. I have a 5.1 home theater kind of setup on that. For my home theater PC setup, I have a 7.1 channel uh, configuration. Love it. Uh, really enjoy audio. I think it goes along, good audio goes along with everything. Gaming, movies, music, whatever. Without that really good sound, it kind of kills it. At least it does for me. And I have to say that I am extremely impressed with this. You know, both with the fit and finish overall design, the connectivity, um, the you know, really accurate sound that it produces and the features on it. It's just completely and totally uh, outstanding. Now, the only real negative to this product is the cost. It is pretty expensive. But other than that, this is a 100% kick-ass product. Until next time, take care.